Hi everyone! Today I'm going to show you how to add a custom watermark to shows made with ProShow Web. Now this option is only available with a premium subscription. If you don't know what type of account you have, just hover over your login information up here at the top of the screen. This will expand and show you your account type. Okay, so what is a watermark? Well, it's something you probably see every day, typically as a logo or brand name in the bottom corner of the screen as you watch TV. Now in ProShow Web, you can add a watermark that will always appear as a semi-transparent image in the lower right corner of your shows. For photographers, slideshow creators, or people using ProShow Web to make promotional videos, watermarks are a great way to add a little bit of extra marketing and promotional power to your shows. Alright, so what kind of images make good watermarks? Well, in ProShow Web, any JPEG or PNG file can be used as a watermark, but I highly recommend using PNG files. They allow you to have a transparent background, and this really helps your watermarks blend more seamlessly into your shows. Alright, let's dive in and add a watermark. Now in ProShow Web, you can add a watermark while you're making a new show, or add one to an already completed show. Now regardless of when you add the watermark, the process and the results will be the same. I'm going to add one to a show I made earlier. Now since this show has already been built, I'll need to click the Edit Show button in order to go back to all of my slides and show settings. Down here at the bottom of the screen, I can click on the title of my show, or click the Settings button over here on the right to open up the options for my show. Now let's scroll to the premium settings and then click the add watermark button. Now I'll locate the image I want to add as my watermark, then click open to upload the image and add it to my show. Once added, I can change or remove the watermark by using these options here. Now that we've added the watermark, there are two things I want to point out here. The first is the preview of the selected image. Now in this case, the preview is not a very good representation of what my logo actually looks like. This is normal. What you see here is just a thumbnail preview. So don't worry if it doesn't look perfect here. Everything will look great once you build the show. The second thing to point out is the reminder telling me the watermark will always appear in the lower right corner of my show. Now keep in mind, this location can't be changed. Watermarks will always appear in the same place for every show. And that's really all there is to adding a watermark. Now let's click the Done button to go back to the workspace, and then build the video to see the results. When I play back the show, I'll see my logo down here in the lower right corner. Now, worth noting is that because of the location and opacity of the watermark, occasionally images or effects may create the illusion that the watermark is being hidden, like this. Again, this is normal. If you see this in your shows and decide you absolutely need to see the watermark, simply go back and choose a new effect for any slides that are being affected. That's it for this lesson. Be sure to visit our blog or check out our YouTube channel for even more helpful ProShow web tips.